Okay, so hello guys. We are here at Carol Sausage and Country Store right off of 75. You guys know this is a place that we like to stop a lot. And so we like to share this with um, Brian's cousin, Lisa. What's wrong? What, what is that? Oh, that's funny. And then the peanut, the big peanut that's always down there standing up, he got blown over by the hurricane. And there's a lot of hurricane damage around through here as well. But I'll show you guys that when we leave. We're gonna walk down there. That looks like little piggy made it. Oh, boy, that car didn't sound good. <sighs> we love it here though. And I just like showing friends and family. Carol Sausage and Country Store. They've got lots of bacon. Look how thick that bacon is. That's buckboard bacon. That's thick applewood bacon. Regular sliced bacon. Pepper bacon. Wow. And look at these. Mild stuffed chops. And then they have this down here which are like these appetizers. So I think I have to do appetizers for our Christmas thing this year. I think stuffed peppers would be good. And that's just like, what is that? Bacon wrapped steak bites. That looks good too. I might have to try those. It's too hot for me. Too spicy? Yeah. You like it, Bri? Which one is it? The habanero? Oh. It just tingles the tongue a little bit. Tingles the tongue. I just the regular one. Like that's actually pretty good. Get that out of my mouth yeah, you couldn't eat, you could eat a whole bunch of those. I mean, it is getting hotter. <laughs> mm. What about the teriyaki? You like that? <coughs> not that bad. It takes a little bit. <laughs> no, I'm not. I don't like that. No. That's gross. What? I didn't like it. No, no, I like it. That's odd, too, well, for you. I love it. Just tell me before I. Yeah. Tex-Mex? Oh, I've never tried a Tex-Mex. We always get the teriyaki. It's like chili, you said. I would like to try a Tex-Mex. <laughs> yeah, I want to try the Tex-Mex. You like the Tex-Mex? Which one's your favorite? Oh, you like the pepper jack? Oh, see, Brian yeah, would probably like pepper jack, too. So, so that's, that's what I mean. Did you taste that one? The, the pepper, pepper jack. You didn't give that to me. You said you. You want pepper jack? Yeah. You turned it away. You, you should try it. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, it's Tex-Mex. Oh, oh, it's Tex-Mex. Well, it's Tex-Mex. 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 Tex-
ground out here too from all of the stuff blowing. Aw, oh, that's sad. Poor little peanut guy. <laughs> no, I don't need that sign. This is my sign right here. Woo woo! <laughs> We're in Florida! Woo woo! This is always such a good sign right there. Except for we're not going to the place that I would like to go to. You're just gonna burn to the ground? <laughs> that was hard! <laughs> Look, there's palm trees. I know, I love that. It's always my favorite thing to see, too. Palm trees, the Florida sign. It's always so nice. I really sure they can call that a tree. It can't even support itself. It needs help. They're supporting themselves. No, they're not. So, we made it to Florida, obviously, and we have stopped at this. McDonald's and racetrack. We went into went to the bathroom. I think Devin's buying a sunscreen visor for the back window because the sun is killing him and I got a shake. And we're about an hour and a half from Tampa, which is the hotel that we're staying at tonight. And then we're gonna check in, get situated, and then go find some food. So we're excited about that. And um, I'm so sad because we're so close to Disney. Um, we are so close to Disney that I cannot even like stand it. And I try to talk them into going to Disney tonight, just like Disney Springs. And everybody's like, yeah, no. So, bummer. Hmm. Oh well, I would Lisa go find Devin. Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty guys, so we made it to our hotel room in Tampa slash Brandon, Florida. We are staying at the Spring Hill Suites in Tampa, Brandon. And we're about 10 miles from the port of Tampa, which is um, where we're gonna board the boat tomorrow. So we're very, very excited about that. It's been a long day, obviously, driving and stuff here. And I also know that Disney's only like one hour away, so I came over here to the window and I'm like, can I at least see Epcot? No, of course not. It's only, it's an hour away. But anyway, nonetheless, we are here and I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys a quick room tour. Um, like I said, this is in Tampa slash Brandon area and it's near uh, Port of Tampa where we're gonna be on our boat tomorrow. But let's go ahead and start with the room. And this is, these are the beds. They're very small beds. They look very small. So I don't think you fit two people on these beds. That's okay. We like to separate anyway when we're sleeping in two beds. Anyway, this is the bathroom area, little sink. Obviously they give you some, it's Paul Mitchell. Facial stuff, shampoo, conditioner, oops. Shampoo and conditioner, towels, a nice mirror. Then over here is the bathroom area. Very nice. Nice bathroom, extra towels and stuff up there. And then over here is a little TV area. You can watch TV and obviously it'll swivel so you can watch it from the bed or you can watch it from inside this little room area. And there's a little desk over there for doing work, putting on makeup, whatever. Little chair, couch where Brian is sitting. And then that's the door for the hotel room. And then over here is like a little bar area where you can have coffee. There's a refrigerator right there. Sink area right there. Coffee and then inside of here is the microwave and um, extra coffee stuff over here as well. So yeah, so very, very nice. So that is our hotel. This is where we are staying for one night before we get on our cruise ship tomorrow. So exciting. See you guys later, bye. So we are at Portillo's. I'm so excited to eat here. We never get to have Portillo's because we don't live in Chicago anymore. And they actually have one here in Brandon. Super excited. Ooh, rocks are back. I got like an old car up there. Mm. So 
we're gonna start with the whole uh, what everybody's having to eat. I got Italian beef with french fries. Brian got Italian beef with french fries. He didn't open it yet. And then he's getting a hot dog. This hot dog is so good. Lisa, what'd you get? Italian beef and a brat. Oh, and a brat. And fries. And look at this healthy guy over here making us all look bad. Salad. Looks good though, Devin. Huh? Do I want a bite of the dog? Oh yeah, I thought you were so we had a nice dinner at Fratillo's. It was so good to finally eat at Fratillo's. We love we love Fratillo's, and for the four of us to be from Chicago and never get it as often as we like, it was so good just to have it. We are back at our hotel. Stopped up at CVS, picked up some water, and we are just going to stay at our hotel and relax for the rest of the night. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. I'll see you guys on the cruise. Bye.